Good day everyone, I'm Maricel Lunisay, Administrative Assistant 3 assigned at Budget Section. Today, I am going to present the attachments for holding, miscellaneous expenses, and utilities. For holding attachments, we have the checklist. First, the petty cash vouchers. Second, report on paid petty cash vouchers. Third, the petty cash record. And last, the receipt. One original and one photo copy. Next, miscellaneous expenses attachment. Summary of expenses. Date, description of particulars, holding company, and the amount should be indicated in this form. It should also be signed by the person who prepared by and reviewed by the provincial lead and approved by the Regional Program Coordinator. Purchase request. Purchase request should also indicate the quantity, unit, item description, stock number, unit cost, and the total cost. It should also be signed or requested by our Regional Program Coordinator and approved by Regional Director. The Inspection and Acceptance Report. Inspection and Acceptance Report indicates the stock or property number, description, unit, and quantity, and signed by the Inspection Officer or for the designated inspector per province, the supply or property custodian, and the end user. Process of vouchers. From POO, the attachments must be signed by the provincial lead, then sent to regional office for pickup and incoming of the assigned staff, then to financial analyst or senior bookkeeper for review of the documents, to regional program coordinator for signature to Deputy Regional Program Coordinator for signature of the obligation request or OBR, and return to Financial Analyst or Senior Bookkeeper for bundle. Then, out to budget. And return to Financial Analyst or Senior Bookkeeper for journal entry voucher and final review. And out to accounting unit for signature of regional accountant to regional director for approval of vouchers and other attachments that needs the approval of the regional director and last to cash unit for check preparation and for utilities billing statements for electricity water and etc Upon receipt of the billing statement, the Provincial Operation Office or POO should provide or send an advanced copy of the billing statement at the regional office. And last, the contract of lease for rentals of office and warehouses. Deadline for submission is every 15th of the following month. And that's all for holding miscellaneous expenses and utilities. Thank you!